Alright guys, so as you can see, those two messages in front of you are sent to my Android device and it's clearly in front of you, but the blue tick or the blue check mark is not there. I'm going to show you how you need to do this. I'm just going to send another message to prove to you guys. The message is sent and it's shown in front of you, but still there's no blue tick. If you don't know how I did this, make sure to stay till the end. Hey guys, so before starting off with the tutorial, I just want to say to everyone, try to stay safe and listen to your government about instructions on how to do the quarantine. Now we're going to go in today's video and I'm going to talk about how to be able to remove the blue check mark on WhatsApp. So if someone sends you a message and you want to see that message without them knowing about it, you're going to know how to do that in today's video. So the first thing you need to do is go to the settings and after that you need to go to and find apps. Make sure to tap on apps and then tap on apps again and drag down until you see your WhatsApp messenger application. Now this is very easy, all you need to do is follow a few steps and you will be able to successfully do that. So like I said, drag down until you see WhatsApp, tap on it and then make sure to tap on the option where it says storage. So tap on storage and then you will be shown with two options, clear data and clear cache. Make sure to do the clear cache one. Tap on that one as well and you're good to go. Now if you guys are enjoying the video, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel. It would really help me out and it will show me that you guys like the video. So with that being said, you need to go to the Play Store and search for an application called Hide Blue Ticks or Last Scenes. Now this application link is in the description below so if you want to download it from there, you're more than welcome. If not, just go and search for the application and press on install. Now my internet is a bit slow, it might take a while so I apologize in advance but I also want to mention again if you guys are enjoying the video and if you want to know how to make this on an iOS device make sure to comment below. I'll try to make one for iOS users as well since it requires a jailbreak but I'll try to clarify that one as well. So after the application is downloaded press on open or tap on open it will prompt you with a few slides just make sure to slide right until you see enable accessibility after that just tap on it and then toggle hide on now it's very important for you to do this you need to toggle the application on and then it shows you with a prompt just tap on allow and that's it you're good to go now after that just tap on return or go back and you will have another prompt thrown to you. Just press on allow again, and then that's it. So I'm gonna go and grab my other phone, which is the iPhone, and I'm going to send myself a message. And if you guys are enjoying the video, make sure to hit the subscribe button. It will show me that you guys are interested in videos like this, and I'll try to make more in the future. So as you can see, that's the iPhone. I'm gonna send myself a message, and I'm not going to even open WhatsApp just to show and prove to you guys that this application is so amazing that you're gonna open the messages no matter if it's a video, a photo or whatever it is you can be able to get to see it without the other person knowing so I'm gonna send myself a message as you can see I sent myself a message saying hi and I'm gonna open that message and you will be able to see it without the other person knowing so as you can see I'm gonna send myself another message right now and I'm not going to even open WhatsApp. So let me just close this. As you can see in front of you, WhatsApp is fully closed. I'm going to go send another message to myself. And then I'm going to open that message from the application that we just installed, which is called Hide. As you can see, that's not WhatsApp. It's the application. And I'm seeing the message and there's no blue tick or blue check mark. So that's it. It's very amazing. It's very easy. And I'm going to show you another thing. I'm going to prove it to you guys by sending another message just to show you guys that this application works properly and it works for videos and photos as well. I think I mentioned this before. So I'm going to send another message. As you can see, the message is shown and there's no blue tick or blue check mark. Now here's the most interesting part about this application. So let's say I want to delete this message. So the message is delivered to the other person and I want to delete it. Now that other person will still be able to see it. As you can see on the Android phone, it's not removed. It's still there. So you get to see that message even if it's removed from the first hand user. That's how amazing it is. So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, make sure to like and share this video if you have other friends that want to know about this. And uh, I hope you guys stay tuned for future videos. Thank you so much for watching and peace out.